yeah, I was very, very sad. I was sad for Oli. Uh, I was sad for the fans. Uh, of course, very, very sad for the club. I don't, I don't think that Manchester United is a club that should necessarily sack their managers. Uh, but it's, we've got just I've got to owe up to the the fourth manager now that we haven't got right. Um, and yeah, very sad. So hopefully now it's an opportunity to get things right. Um, I, th I hope there's a lot of hard work going into the due diligence now in terms of who will be the next guy. I'm a bit confused about the, co the communication that comes out of Man United. This idea about an interim manager up until the summer and then somebody else from there. But if that is the case, you know, that a few former players has put the hat a name in the hat. Someone like Steve Bruce could be, you know, a really good option. Uh, safe pair of hands to take uh, to take charge of the team and the club for the rest of the season. But uh, you know, if I'm honest, I hope that the the next manager uh, will be picked and will be in place uh, before uh, an interim manager is because uh, I, I don't think the club needs to have that kind of confusion. Um, I don't want to really want to go into that. I mean, Oli paid the price. I think. I think what the team more than anything needs is new voices in the dressing room, some something different, uh, another kind of inspiration. And, and it, it, it kind of feels like even Michael Carrick said that he'd worked with with Oli Gunnar for, for so long, and he's going to be the same as him. So that's probably not what the team needs. But he did really well in, in Villarreal, but it's just one game. Um, I think it's very important that we get a, a manager in place and and then we, we can start to look towards the future. I think it's a big call. I think the competition, Chelsea, which, well, obviously we'll play Chelsea next. Um, <clears throat> Chelsea, they look very strong. Liverpool looks very, very strong. And Man City, yeah, well, it, it, I think it, it's a big, big gap to close, but you never know, it's football. So uh, as long as we're not completely out of it, that's a chance.